This is Ashley Dean, Extension Entomologist for Field Crops at Iowa State University, and I'm out evaluating some soybean trials today near Ames. And what I have here is a false Japanese beetle. They usually come out about a week before real Japanese beetles do, but in this field I have seen both false Japanese beetles and Japanese beetles. You can tell that this is a false Japanese beetle because it's pretty dull. It's mostly coppery brown compared to the real Japanese beetle, which has kind of a metallic green color on its body and golden coppery elytra. This false Japanese beetle also doesn't have those six white tufts of hair at the end of the abdomen. It's a little hard to see. They do have the tufts of hair, but they're not bright white like the Japanese beetle. The false Japanese beetles are not really a concern for field crops. Obviously they're in soybean, but they don't really feed on soybean like Japanese beetle does. So um, if you see these guys, they're not as much of a concern as the real Japanese beetles.